have a man who is given the title of being Shaheed, not simply because he was killed, but a Shaheed is given the title of being one who witnesses because through their life, through their example, to the very end of it, they bear witness to the fact that there is something that is bigger than this world that they are striving for. There is something that is bigger than the shackles, the distractions of this dunya. Something that they orient their values towards. Something that are their guiding principles. Something that are their morals. Something that is their sense of ethics. Something that drives their mindfulness. And we find this in the tragedy of Karbala, where we see Hussein radiallahu an to the very end being a purveyor of that sense of his values. The realities of Karbala should not be something that we segment into theological divides that allow for us to be only engaging them at simplistic levels. If you are a Shia or you are a Sunni, you have to know what took place at that time. And you have to understand that the individuals who were massacred and slaughtered on that day were not people that we are meant to have tangential relationships with. These were the children of the Prophet of God.